All right, let's turn it around to something that will get you feeling good, right? Have you ever woken up in the morning and you feel your feet feel a little tingly yeah. or maybe they're still asleep? It, it's happened to me before, but mm -hmm. that's what happened to this week's Kylie's kind of like kid. But for Jackie, that numb, tingly feeling didn't go away. In fact, it got worse. Yeah. And even after losing feeling in her legs, Jackie's attitude is one of the best you will ever meet. I played softball and I volleyball down there. You can um, tell a lot about Jackie just by looking at her blanket. There's just different ones from all over. Like this was in like sixth grade or something. From shirts that are very well loved. I wore it forever and ever and ever. To quotes that hit close to home. Volunteers are not paid not because they are worthless but because they're priceless. I really like that because I'm part of the National Honor Society. While the rows of t-shirts are certainly heartwarming. So I have no feeling which is kind of bizarre, but <laughs> Jackie can't feel just how warm it's keeping her legs. Monday morning I woke up and I had like pins and needles in my feet and I thought I had just slept funny on it and then by the night it was up to my knees and then I woke up on Tuesday and couldn't feel anything from my belly button down. Turns out Jackie has Guillain-Barre, a condition where the immune system attacks the nerves. It's a little bit freaky, but I don't know. It's, I'm getting better at walking without the feeling. It's a big change of pace for this high school athlete from dancing at her senior prom just a few months ago. It's funny this morning we danced through the hallways a little bit. <laughs> to learning the moves all over again. Uh, one of the nurses played music and I was trying to trying to get my feet to work and <laughs> it was funny to dance along with the music. As Jackie heads to North Dakota for her first year of college. It's funny I want to be an occupational therapist so I've met a lot of a lot of neat occupational therapists here. She may have an extra edge on her classmates. And it's funny I've been like is this job shadowing? Can this count? Can I write it down on my little paper? <laughs> Jackie says she is slowly getting feeling back. It's now a little above her knee, so she was able to start her freshman year at UND. She says she's having so much fun, and she can't wait to fully recover so she can play intramural volleyball. But I gotta say, you walk in there, and she mm -hmm. is the most positive, upbeat person. I mean, you just just contagious instantly. You can feel her spirit just there, so it's yeah. great. It's great. Hopefully, she'll get a full recovery. What a what a crazy. Yeah. Crazy sensation. It, it is looking like that's that's what yeah. will happen, that's but you know great. it takes a while, and she can still function. She just can't sure. feel just anything, can't feel especially if you're an athlete. That's tough. Yeah. But she yeah. was she was so positive. She's like, you know, like I got all this training from an occupational therapist mm. right before I go to school to become one. True, true. Oh, awesome. That is pretty neat. Yeah, we wish her the best.